Everyone wants to stay fit and look young as long as possible. We all know that eating right and being physically active are good habits. But did you know you should train your facial muscles just like you train your body? Otherwise, they lose their firmness as you age. Now you might think, oh gosh, one more thing to train. I've just paid for our gym membership. No worries. You don't need a gym or special equipment for the following exercises. You can perform them right now in front of your computer. So let's begin the seven most effective exercises to get rid of a double chin. First, just like before any other workout, you need to warm up your facial muscles. Move your lower jaw forward and backward and then side to side. Do all movements slowly and smoothly without sudden jerks. Repeat eight to 10 times. Now, let's get on to the first exercise, the scoop. Open your mouth and roll your bottom lip over your lower teeth. Imagine that you need to scoop water with your lower jaw. Move your head down in a scooping motion and close your mouth while lifting your head. While doing this exercise, make sure that the corners of your lips are completely relaxed. Repeat five to seven times. Isn't it a piece of cake? Then, move on to the second exercise, nose touching. A double chin is associated with weak hyoid muscles, so you need to strengthen them. Stick out your tongue as far as possible and try to touch your nose with the tip of your tongue. Keep your lips relaxed and repeat the exercise five times. If you wanna pull your cheeks up, try out the third exercise. Turn your head to the left and pull your lower jaw forward, straining your neck muscles. You should feel the muscles on the left side of your neck stretching. Then turn your head to the right and do the same. Repeat five times on each side. We call the fourth exercise, kiss the giraffe. Imagine you need to kiss a giraffe. <laughs> Come on, giraffes need some love too. Okay, okay. Just imagine you're going to kiss someone really tall. Lift your face up and look at the ceiling. Slightly bring your lower jaw forward and pucker your lips as if you're going to kiss someone. If you're doing it right, you will feel a strong tension in your neck. Hold this position for five to eight seconds and release. Repeat five times. For the fifth exercise, which we call resistance, make two fists and place them directly under your chin. Then begin to move your lower jaw slightly down on your fists and strain your muscles overcoming the resistance. Increase the pressure gradually. When you reach maximum resistance, hold it for three seconds, then relax and repeat the exercise five to seven times. The sixth exercise, puffy cheeks, is kind of cute and fun. Inhale deeply through your mouth and fill it with air. Close the mouth and puff up your cheeks. Now press your palms on your cheeks so that you feel the tension in your muscles. Hold for three to five seconds, then exhale and relax. Repeat the exercise five to six times. Here is the last, and my favorite, smile. Clench your teeth with your mouth closed and stretch the corners of your lips as wide as possible. Now push your tongue against the roof of your mouth, gradually increasing the pressure. If you feel a strong tension in your chin muscles, then well done, you're doing great. Hold this for five seconds and then relax for three seconds. Repeat five to eight times. By the way, this exercise also works perfectly to lift up your mood when you're feeling down. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, hit that thumbs up button. And if you're visiting our channel for the first time, click subscribe to stay with us on Brightside.